In the year 2357, on the distant planet of Zerian Prime, a catastrophic event unfolded that would forever change the course of the galaxy. The Zerians, a highly advanced alien species known for their technological prowess and strategic intellect, believed themselves to be the undisputed masters of the cosmos. With their formidable military might and superior intellect, they had conquered countless worlds, subjugating entire civilizations to their rule. However, the Zerians made a grave miscalculation when they set their sights on a peculiar blue planet located in the outskirts of the Milky Way galaxy. Humanity, as the inhabitants of this unassuming world called themselves, had only recently begun to explore the stars, their technology still in its infancy compared to that of the Zerians. Underestimating the resourcefulness and resilience of the human race, the Zerians launched a full-scale invasion of Earth, confident that victory would come swiftly and easily. Their armada descended upon the planet, unleashing devastating weapons of war upon the unsuspecting humans below, but the Zerians had failed to account for the indomitable spirit of humanity. The people of Earth, faced with imminent annihilation, rose up to defend their world with a ferocity that caught the Zerians off guard. Despite the vast technological disparity between the two civilizations, the humans refused to yield, fighting tooth and nail to protect their home. As the war raged on, the Zerians soon realized their fatal error. The humans, resourceful and inventive, adapted quickly to the alien technology, turning the tide of the conflict in ways the Zerians had never imagined. Their determination to survive, coupled with their innovative tactics, proved to be a formidable obstacle for the once confident Zerians. Caught off guard by the tenacity of the humans, the Zerians found themselves on the defensive, their once mighty empire crumbling under the weight of their own arrogance. As humanity continued to push back against their alien invaders, the Zerians saw their dreams of conquest turn into a bitter nightmare. Now, as the dust settled and the ruins of Zerium Prime smoldered in the aftermath of the war, the surviving members of the alien species pondered their defeat with disbelief. They had underestimated the resolve of humanity, and in doing so, they had sealed their own fate. Little did they know that the true power of humanity lay not in their weapons or technology, but in their capacity for empathy, ingenuity, and unwavering determination. And as the remnants of the Zerian Empire grappled with the consequences of their folly, they could only watch in awe as the humans began to rebuild their shattered world, stronger and more resilient than ever before. In the wake of the devastating war between humanity and the Zerians, Earth stood scarred but undefeated. The once great Zerion Empire lay in ruins, their fleets decimated and their civilization on the brink of collapse. As the dust settled and the smoke cleared, a new era dawned for both races, a time of reckoning and reflection. Among the ruins of Zerion Prime, a small group of alien survivors gathered, their once proud society reduced to ashes. They had underestimated humanity's capacity for resistance and paid a heavy price for their hubris. Now, as they surveyed the destruction wrought by their failed invasion, a sense of profound regret gnawed at their core. One Zerian in particular, named Vexil, a high-ranking military strategist who had overseen the ill-fated campaign against Earth, grappled with overwhelming guilt and remorse. He had been instrumental in planning the invasion, convinced of the Zerian's superiority over the primitive humans. But now, faced with the devastating consequences of his actions, Vexil found himself haunted by doubt and self-recrimination. As he wandered through the desolate streets of what was once a bustling Zerion city, Vexil encountered remnants of human resistance fighters who had bravely stood against the alien onslaught. Among them was Captain Sarah Reynolds, a resilient and resourceful leader who had inspired her fellow humans to rise up against the invaders. Despite their initial hostilities, Vexil and Sarah found common ground in their shared experiences of loss and devastation. As they exchanged stories of the war and its aftermath, a tentative understanding began to blossom between the two former adversaries. Sarah spoke of humanity's struggle for survival and resilience in the face of overwhelming odds, while Vexil recounted the hubris and folly of the Zerians' failed conquest. Together, they ventured into the heart of the ruined city, 
their footsteps echoing through the empty streets as they bore witness to the devastation wrought by war. Amidst the rubble and ruins, they found fragments of their respective civilizations, the remnants of a once great empire, and a resilient species determined to rebuild from the ashes. As they stood together amidst the ruins, a sense of shared purpose began to emerge, a recognition that despite their differences, both races shared a common desire for peace and understanding. And as they gazed out at the shattered remnants of a once proud civilization, Vexil and Sarah knew that the path to redemption would be long and arduous, but not impossible. With a newfound sense of determination and mutual respect, they set out to forge a new future, a future built not on conquest and conflict, but on cooperation and coexistence. And as they walked side by side through the ruins of a world torn apart by war, they knew that the true test of their metal had only just begun. In the aftermath of the devastating war between the Zerians and humanity, tentative steps were taken towards reconciliation and cooperation. The ruins of Zerion Prime served as a stark reminder of the consequences of unchecked hubris and the destructive nature of conflict. Amidst the rubble, a fragile alliance began to form between the two once warring civilizations. Exil, the remorseful Zerian strategist, and Captain Sarah Reynolds, the resilient human leader, found themselves at the forefront of this nascent alliance. Together, they sought to bridge the divide between their peoples and forge a path towards a more hopeful future. A future defined by cooperation and understanding, rather than by mistrust and animosity. As they worked tirelessly to rebuild what had been destroyed by war, Vexil and Sarah faced numerous challenges and obstacles. Deep-seated prejudices and lingering resentments threatened to derail their efforts at every turn, but they remained steadfast in their commitment to building a better world for both races. One of the key challenges they faced was the scarcity of vital resources needed to rebuild their shattered civilizations. With Earth and Zerium Prime both reeling from the devastating impact of the war, cooperation and mutual assistance became paramount. Human engineers and Zerium scientists worked side by side, pooling their knowledge and expertise to develop innovative solutions to the myriad problems they faced. Slowly but steadily, the ruins of Zerium Prime began to take on new life as the combined efforts of humans and Zerians bore fruit. Skyscrapers once reduced to rubble rose from the ashes, gleaming with newfound promise. Parks and gardens bloomed amidst the ruins, a testament to the resilience of life in the face of destruction. Yet, despite the progress made, shadows of doubt and mistrust still lingered. Old wounds ran deep and the scars of war were not easily erased. Vexil and Sarah knew that true reconciliation would take time and patience, but they were determined to see it through to the end. As they stood together atop a newly rebuilt tower, gazing out at the cityscape below, Vexil and Sarah shared a moment of quiet reflection. In the distance, the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm golden glow over the revitalized city. This is just the beginning, Sarah said, breaking the silence. There is much work to be done, but I believe we can build a better future together. Vexil nodded, a sense of hope blossoming within him. Indeed, Captain. Together, we can overcome the trials of the past and forge a new path forward, one built on unity and understanding. And as they looked towards the horizon, where the light of a new day was beginning to emerge, Vexil and Sarah knew that the road ahead would be arduous. But they also knew that as long as they stood united, there was nothing they could not overcome. As the fragile alliance between humanity and the Zerians continued to solidify, New challenges arose that tested the resolve and commitment of both races. The remnants of war still lingered in the hearts and minds of many, threatening to unravel the hard-forged unity that Vexil and Sarah had worked so tirelessly to cultivate. One of the greatest challenges came in the form of rogue factions within both civilizations, 
groups who harbored deep-seated resentments and sought to undermine the fragile peace that had been established. These extremist elements, fueled by fear and prejudice, saw the burgeoning alliance as a threat to their own interests and were willing to resort to violence to maintain the status quo. Dexil and Sarah found themselves faced with a new adversary, one that lurked within their own ranks, sowing seeds of discord and mistrust. As acts of sabotage and violence began to escalate, the unity that had once seemed so promising hung in the balance. Despite the threats that loomed on the horizon, Vexil and Sarah refused to back down. They knew that the path to true peace and reconciliation was fraught with challenges, but they remained steadfast in their resolve to see it through to the end. Together, they embarked on a mission to root out the dissenters and purveyors of discord, working tirelessly to protect the fragile alliance they had fought so hard to build. Through a combination of diplomacy and decisive action, they sought to quell the rising tensions and prevent further acts of aggression from tearing their world apart once more. Amidst the turmoil and chaos, a glimmer of hope emerged as individuals from both races began to stand together against the forces of division and hatred. Human and Zerium civilians alike joined hands in solidarity, demonstrating that the desire for peace and understanding transcended the petty grievances of the past. One defining moment came when Vexil and Sarah stood side by side before a gathering of their people, their voices ringing out in unison as they spoke of the importance of unity and cooperation. They urged their fellow citizens to let go of the bitterness and hatred that had festered for so long, and to embrace a future built on mutual respect and understanding. And as their words resonated with the crowd, a sense of collective purpose began to take root, bridging the divide that had once seemed insurmountable. In that moment, Vexil and Sarah knew that despite the trials that lay ahead, they had laid the foundation for a brighter and more harmonious future, one where humanity and the Zerians could coexist in peace and prosperity. The days turned into weeks, and the weeks into months, as the alliance between humanity and the Zerians continued to strengthen in the face of adversity. The efforts of Vexil and Sarah, along with the support of their allies, had borne fruit as the seeds of unity and cooperation began to flourish in the once war-torn lands of Zerian Prime. The rogue factions that had sought to disrupt the fragile peace had been dealt with decisively, their nefarious schemes thwarted by the unwavering determination of those who believed in a better future for all. Slowly but surely, trust and understanding bloomed between humans and Zerians, fostering a sense of camaraderie and mutual respect that had once seemed impossible. As the cityscape of Zerion Prime gleamed with newfound vitality and promise, Vexil and Sarah stood together at the precipice of a new dawn. The scars of war still lingered, but they served as a reminder of the resilience and strength of those who had weathered the storm and emerged on the other side, united in purpose and vision. In a symbol of solidarity, a grand ceremony was held to commemorate the alliance between humanity and the Zerians. Leaders from both races stood before a throng of their fellow citizens, their voices ringing out in a chorus of hope and renewal. We stand here today not as enemies, but as partners in a shared future, Sarah declared, her voice carrying across the gathering. Together, we have overcome the trials of the past and forged a path towards a brighter tomorrow, a tomorrow built on cooperation and understanding. Vixil echoed her sentiments, his eyes shining with a newfound sense of purpose. Let us move forward together, hand in hand, as equals and friends. Let us build a world where peace reigns and where the lessons of the past guide us towards a future filled with promise. And as the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm golden glow over the city below, a sense of peace and tranquility settled over Zerion Prime. The people, once divided by centuries of mistrust and conflict, now stood united in their determination to create a better world for themselves and future generations. In that moment of unity and solidarity, Vexil and Sarah knew that the trials they had faced were but a prelude to the challenges that still lay ahead. But with the unwavering support of their allies and the shared belief in a brighter future, they were ready to face whatever obstacles came their way, knowing that as long as they stood together, there was nothing they could not overcome. And so, 
As a new day dawned over the revitalized city of Zerion Prime, humanity and the Zerians embraced the promise of tomorrow, a promise born of unity, understanding, and the boundless potential of two civilizations joined in common purpose. As the alliance between humanity and the Zerians flourished, news of their remarkable reconciliation spread throughout the galaxy, sparking hope and inspiration among countless civilizations. The tale of two once warring races coming together in unity and cooperation resonated far and wide, igniting a flame of optimism in the hearts of beings across the stars. Moved by the remarkable transformation of Earth and Zerion, prime from worlds ravaged by war to beacons of peace and collaboration, Emissaries from various alien civilizations began to converge on the two planets. They came not as conquerors or rivals, but as partners in a shared vision of interstellar harmony and understanding. In a momentous gathering that would shape the fate of the galaxy, representatives from Earth, Zerion Prime, and a myriad of other worlds convened to establish the Galactic Council, a forum dedicated to fostering diplomacy, cooperation, and mutual Respect among all sentient beings, Vexil and Sarah, once adversaries turned allies, stood at the forefront of this historic assembly, their commitment to peace and unity serving as a beacon of hope for the galaxy at large. Together, they addressed the gathered delegates, their voices resounding with sincerity and conviction. As representatives of humanity and the Zerians, we have seen firsthand the devastation that comes from conflict and the boundless potential that arises from cooperation, Sarah proclaimed, her gaze sweeping across the diverse assembly. Let us not repeat the mistakes of the past, but rather forge a future where all beings can thrive in harmony. Vexil, his eyes shining with determination, added, let this council be a testament to the power of unity and understanding. Let us set aside our differences and come together as equals, sharing our knowledge and resources for the betterment of all who call the stars their home. And so, amidst a chorus of affirmation and encouragement, the Galactic Council was established, a symbol of hope and unity in a galaxy rife with conflict and division. Delegates from every corner of known space pledged to work together towards a future built on cooperation, respect, and the shared pursuit of knowledge and prosperity. As the inaugural session drew to a close, a sense of possibility hung in the air, a vision of a brighter future where old enmities could be set aside in favor of a new era of peace and understanding. For Vexil, Sarah, and all those gathered, the journey towards galactic unity had only just begun, but the possibilities were limitless, fueled by the unwavering belief that together they could shape a destiny greater than any individual race could achieve alone. With the establishment of the Galactic Council, heralding a new era of cooperation among the diverse civilizations of the galaxy, the unity forged between humanity, the Zerians, and other member races faced its first significant test. Challenges arose that tested the resolve and commitment of the Council members, threatening to strain the delicate bonds of interstellar harmony that had been painstakingly built. One of the foremost challenges came in the form of a border dispute between two neighboring star systems, an ancient conflict rooted in generations of mistrust and territorial disputes. As tensions escalated and the threat of conflict loomed on the horizon, the Galactic Council was faced with a critical decision. Intervene and seek a peaceful resolution, or risk the outbreak of a new war that could engulf the entire region in chaos. Vexil, now a respected advocate for diplomacy and reconciliation, stood at the forefront of efforts to defuse the escalating crisis. Drawing upon the lessons learned from the past struggles of Earth and Zerion Prime, he urged the Council members to set aside their differences and work towards a peaceful resolution through dialogue and negotiation. Sarah, ever the pragmatic leader, lent her unwavering support to Vexil's diplomatic endeavors, 
recognizing that the resolution of the border dispute could set a precedent for future conflicts within the galaxy. Together, they embarked on a delicate mission of shuttle diplomacy, shuttling between the rival factions to broker a sustainable peace agreement. The road to reconciliation was fraught with challenges as deep-seated animosities and grievances threatened to derail the negotiation process at every turn. However, Vexil and Sarah persevered, employing their skills of empathy, patience and strategic thinking to bridge the divide between the warring factions. As the talks progressed and tempers gradually cooled, a breakthrough finally emerged, a comprehensive peace accord that addressed the underlying causes of the conflict and laid the groundwork for lasting cooperation and mutual respect. The rival factions, once sworn enemies, now stood on the cusp of a new era of understanding and partnership. With the signing of the peace accord, a wave of relief swept through the Galactic Council, reaffirming the power of diplomacy and unity in resolving disputes and fostering interstellar harmony. Vexil and Sarah, having weathered the trials of unity once again, stood as beacons of hope and inspiration, demonstrating that even the most entrenched divisions could be overcome through dialogue and mutual understanding. As the galaxy began to heal from the wounds of conflict, the resolve of the council members only strengthened, reaffirming their shared commitment to a future where cooperation, respect and unity prevailed over discord and strife. And so, the Galactic Council marched forward, united in their shared vision of a peaceful and prosperous galaxy bound by the ties of friendship and cooperation. As the Galactic Council navigated the trials of unity and cooperation, a new challenge emerged that tested the collective resolve of all member races. Reports began to surface of a mysterious anomaly on the fringes of explored space, a phenomenon that defied all conventional understanding and posed a grave threat to the stability of the galaxy. The anomaly, known as the Rift, emanated dark energies that warped spacetime itself creating disturbances that disrupted communication, navigation, and even the fabric of reality. As the effects of the rift spread like ripples across the galaxy, fear and uncertainty gripped the hearts of beings far and wide, casting a shadow of doubt over the newfound unity of the Galactic Council. Vexil and Sarah, their past experiences in overcoming adversity, serving as a beacon of hope in the face of uncertainty, were among the first to heed the call for action. Recognizing the magnitude of the threat posed by the rift, they rallied their allies and prepared to embark on a daring mission to investigate the anomaly and uncover its true nature. Armed with courage and determination, Vexil, Sarah, and a select team of experts from various member races set out towards the heart of the rift, braving the unknown dangers that lurked within its inky depths. As they navigated the unpredictable anomalies and disturbances that surrounded them, a sense of foreboding cast a pall over their mission, hinting at the unfathomable mysteries that awaited them. As they ventured deeper into the heart of the rift, they encountered strange phenomena that defied all logic and reason. Temporal distortions, spatial anomalies, and manifestations of energies hitherto unseen. The very fabric of reality seemed to warp and twist around them, challenging their perceptions and testing their resilience in the face of the unknown. Amidst the chaos and uncertainty, Vexil and Sarah remained resolute, drawing upon their shared experiences and unwavering trust in each other to navigate the dangers that lay ahead. Together, they delved into the heart of the rift, determined to unravel its mysteries and uncover the truth behind its enigmatic existence. As they braved the perilous depths of the anomaly, a revelation slowly began to dawn upon them, a realization that the rift was not merely a natural phenomenon, but a sentient entity of unimaginable power and intelligence, seeking to assert its dominion over the galaxy. In the face of this revelation, Vexil and Sarah knew that the true test of their unity and resolve had only just begun, for the shadows of the unknown loomed large before them, casting doubts and fears that threatened to tear the very fabric of the Galactic Alliance asunder. And as they stood on the precipice of an uncertain future, they knew that the fate of the galaxy rested on their shoulders, bound by a shared destiny that would determine the course of civilizations yet to come.